Anyhow, uh, my name is Dr. Ghulam Farooq. Uh, we are here in Pakistan. Uh, Pakistan, the Muslim country in the world, in the most beautiful country in the world because in the world ranking, Pakistan now is on the top in the world for the visiting point. Uh, uh, I am a major cardiologist. Uh, anyhow, I want to share uh, this video with all the uh, human beings in the world. Uh, yeah, so, uh, the health problems in the world are 83% uh, people are, I think, suffering of health problems just due to mistakes of the human beings, not from the real God. Uh, yeah, so, uh, in Quran, there, is, there was a special diet which is called Mansalwa, uh, that was from the God. Uh, then some ethnicity people refuse uh, the God ban their diet. Then the God uh, advised to some ethnicity people that you can eat all the things except pork and the blood which is flowing. And when there is no Allah Akbar, if someone is uh, uh, eating the meats of some animals, then some ethnicity people in the world is refused. So the God banned fats and meats in Torah and some ethnicity people in the world. Then the Quran is in uh, Surah Anam, uh, Ayat number 146. You can eat uh, you cannot eat the fats which is attached to the entrails and the bones. There is a very special uh, story in Quran. There was a young boys which is called a swabika, when they go, uh, they refuse to accept the order from uh, the Kanus, uh, they went to the uh, hill and there was cave. Uh, the, there were two mouths of the cave, one toward the north and the second to the south. And they were sleeping in that cave for more than 309 years. As in Quran, Surah so Kaf, Ayat number 117, Shaman, when they change the side to the right, the sunlight diverted <coughs> to another side. They went go to the left. There was no direct rays on the skin of a swabika for the last of three zero nine years. And when some Muslim men is walking, the uh, one third of the Lego, just like this, this portion should be exposed to the, should be exposed. If that skin is covered by cloth, that skin will be not good to Janat. So when the human being is born in the world, uh, anyone in the world, if that is Muslim or uh, anyone which is born in the world, uh, I will be summarized because he is my researcher, uh, uh, I'm sorry, he's missing in this time. So there is a, um, the mother uh, milk is deficient in two things, is a serum, uh, vitamin D bone level and magnesium. All the females which are vitamin D deficient, 84%, uh, 60% hospital delivery. And when the baby is born at home or at hospital, the mother milk is deficient in two things, magnesium and SD. So the uh, two lakh international unit vitamin D should be given to the baby. Uh, and up to uh, then after five months, the lower limb skin should be exposed five minutes uh, every day and at age of 10 months, 10 inches every day to the sunlight, direct the skin. Then uh, after three years, the whole body should be exposed to the sunlight. Uh, but uh, as in um, humans being, uh, one should be not expose the skin in the public places. So one can expose in the home. So this sunlight is come to skin, to hit the skin, the epidermis layer, which have two layers, basically in spongiosum, and there is seven dihydrocholesterol. When seven dihydrocholesterol is hit by the ultraviolet B rays, that seven dihydrocholesterol is changed to pre vitamin D3, which is also called colicalciparol. And they come to the liver, in the liver, first hydroxylation D2 in the kidney, second hydroxylation, which is called active bone vitamin, and they come to the small intestine. If someone not use direct sunlight on the skin, that 7 dihydrocholesterol has changed to cholesterol. So they lead to hyperlipidemia, and which is the number one cause of death in the world. Uh, if that 7 dihydrocholesterol has changed to colicalciferol, the colicalciferol, which is called active vitamin, bone vitamin, smart vitamin, they uh, function three in the uh, intestine. They absorb the calcium part of the bone and teeth. 
in absorb the magnesium and there is proper function of the zinc in the presence of proper vitamin D. <coughs> so when the uh, magnesium deficiency the babies there is uh, slivation artism and cochlear nerve become weak so there is early deafness and the vestibular nerve become weak so there is dizziness and loss of here and whitening uh, before uh, the recommended time because premature we are suffering of so health many problems and there is depression, anxiety and panic attacks and tachycardia and burning soul and there is a sweating, very sweating and dry mouth and um, uh, there is obsessive compulsive syndrome and um, loss of appetite and someone is tied by suicide and homicide. And when there is proper use of zinc, uh, they boost the immune system of human and animals. So we are facing infections just like tuberculosis and malignancies and some allergies in like corona. Corona is the white circle around the sun. Uh, as Infanson awarded uh, Nobel Prize because they treated, uh, he was treated the low phosphoric acid with just was phototherapy. Also, as the inventor of the D that was given butter to the rats, and the rats become healthy in the vision were decreased uh, before uh, with decreased vision the red but after using butter the vision improved when they heated the butter the uh, reds lost the vision but they were healthy they labeled that is called d so when come to uh, if there is bone vitamin deficiency there is increased parathyroid hormone secondly hyperparathyroidism so the parathyroid hormone uh, secondary to uh, hypovitaminosis D as the parathyroid hormone is called tip of the bones are the rate which treating the roots of the tree. So they now remove the calcium from the bones to fulfill the requirements of the uh, body. So they remove calcium from the bones so uh, there is records and they uh, first hit the first joint then come to the uh, to hit the uh, neck of the femur and then the vertebrae and then the joints and the whole body uh, pains and uh, fatigue and the ossicles become weaker so there is early deafness and short stature and loss of teeth and as in secondary hyperparathyroidism there is more excretion of the calcium from the renal tubule so they lead to renal stone so uh, why be suffering of a reverse disease in the top in the world in the second is premature osteoporosis as we know when the age of 16 uh, the bone density has start to decrease if someone is normal up to 16 years one person bone loss in density loss in the male and six person in the female in the age of 30 years uh, 12 percent bone density is decreased loss in the male and 26 percent in the females as in the world so many people are using steroids for body pains or asthma or allergies because uh, when the vitamin d is in increased uh, more than normal toxicity one should be good steroids because steroid is called uh, enemy of the bone so in conclusion if some, you, someone using sunlight on the skin along with cholesterol and diet one can go for healthy life but uh, this is very very interested if someone using supplements uh, other than natural vitamin d and using sunlight at the same time as supplements they lead to toxicity when the vitamin d toxicity uh, they lead to rupture in the brain uh, rupture of the vessel in the brain and renal shutdown. Because this is what is, uh, why this is happening, because God knows uh, better than uh, human beings. So we are suffering of health problems which is the mistake of the human beings, not from the God. Yes, uh, uh, I, my name is Dr. Farooq. Because uh, uh, in the whole world, there is no uh, cardiovascular events or diabetes before pain in the bodies or the joints in the bank. Uh, uh, that is the reason the sunlight is arising from the east and they go to the west. They can never come back. But one day it will be there, will be the sun will be arise from the west and they will be go to the east and that will be the end of this world. Uh, I think uh, I will be explained in easy words. One day now, the, uh, this is natural, the sun is arising from the east and they go to the west. But when the end of this world, the sun will be suddenly <coughs> arise from the west and that will be the last day of this earth. So we uh, should be sharing the knowledge. Anyhow, uh, here I want to share with one case. Uh, this is a case of uh, 21 years old man uh, in Pakistan. Look at the bone, a severe osteophenia. Look at this. 
in the D level as just uh, look at the world tapering. And this is just 21 years. Here I am here one case, another Apo, which is a, a baby, uh, just five years baby. Uh, look at uh, uh, on the giants, uh, because uh, uh, look at the giants. This, look at the, this is femur, and this is the tibia. And uh, look at this, this is fusion. Look at this, I magnify. So uh, look at the bones. So that was the records in tuberculosis and polio, which were labeled dogs diseases. Now there is health problems more than 184 due to not using direct sunlight on the skin. Uh, uh, this is a very, very interesting case because if, uh, I will be sharing here the, uh, the uh, what is the thing in the body which is converted to colecholesterol when hit by the sunlight? That is 7-dihydrocholesterol. The whole world so far don't know. Uh, look at this. Uh, this, uh, this was uh, June 2020 and the cholesterol was 169 and the D level just in. Today, today we have, today we have repeated. Uh, look uh, uh, in four months. <laughs> four months. Uh, just look at the cholesterol level. That is 142 and the D level is a... Uh, 26. That was the cholesterol mm, because uh, we have given special instructions to the babies. To, uh, after 10 days, one can use more butter and fats and diet, all the halal thing along with the yak, but will be used more sunlight. Where that cholesterol now? So that is the reason we are suffering health problems, not from the God. Unfortunately, I am put on this very, very famous words mm, 4,000 years back, Suresh we are sitting in the sire because this word is used 4,000 years back as vitamin D is invented in 1821. So anyhow, we want to love to one another. We should be asking the whole world if someone is coming at the clinic, are you using direct sunlight on the skin? Anyone can ask in the world, can reply to me. And are you know about vitamin D? What is your level? One should be asked this. So one day it should become as in Greece and Germany. That uh, home will be not as safe when there is no place for using up sunlight. That factory will be not safe and that hospital will be not safe. Yes, uh, these are all present in the literature. But so far in the world no one knows what is the uh, uh, what is the substrate in the skin when that skin is hit by ultraviolet B rays and that change to colical separo. So that is 7 dihydrocholesterol ten, uh, converted to colical separol, which is the chemical name of the bone atom. Okay, thank you. Assalamu alaikum.